Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Tuesday the 5th of September 2023. I hope you are keeping well. Uh, it's Tuesday that for the Guardian that means a medium level puzzle. Although to be honest with you most Tuesdays it's a pretty easy game and beginners are usually capable of completing this puzzle on a Tuesday. Uh, we'll find out if that's true in a moment. Uh, I noticed that um, according to The Guardian, um, Kim Jong-un is going to travel to Russia to meet Putin. Uh, if I remember correctly, doesn't Kim Jong-un always need his travel in his own special train? Doesn't he have a train that he goes everywhere with? It's a bit noisy outside. It's used the background sounds if you're picking them up. Um, he travels in a, in a train, doesn't he? And Putin... Uh, what we've seen of him recently sits at a table that's like 20 feet long or something. <laughs> and so I can imagine the two of them. I can imagine Kim Jong-un shouting out of his train window, hello, Mr. Putin, and Putin s shouting back at the end of a long table, okay, let me buy some weapons. <laughs> uh, I don't know how it's going to work out. All right, let's get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? Um, we have uh, ones blocking across this row here and ones blocking across, across this row here. If you don't know what I mean by blocking across, check out yesterday's easy level game that will explain the rules of Sudoku. And that's going to put a one in that square there. And we've got a six blocking across here. That's going to put a six there. Um, we will be left here with seven, eight, nine. And we have nine blocking up here and nine blocking up here. So that will be our nine. And so we will have seven and eight in those squares there. Um, right, let's come back to the numbers that we've put in and see if we can find out some more. Uh, about the sixes. Oh, okay. So we've got... Uh, Oh, one's on that side, six is on that side, okay. And the nines. All right. So we have three across here, and three across here, and three down, and down here. That will give us three in this block, in this location. And we have three across here, and three up here. That will put a three here. Three back this way, and this way. Excuse me. Back to using the keyboard again, which I never <laughs> can hit the right key on. And we have uh, one blocking this square and one blocking this square. So in this row, that's going to be a one. Um, okay, we have the four blocking this square here. In this column, we don't have a four yet, so we do now. And we will finish, uh, well, well, let's put the f extra four in while we can, I guess. Let's do that quickly, four like so. And uh, we can finish this with a six. Uh, excuse me. We can finish this with a seven, sorry. My apologies. Uh, I already, I've worked out previously sixes are on this side, so that was a bit silly. Never mind. Um, what are we looking for over here? We're looking for... Um, Two six eight. Okay. Uh, we have one blocking down here and one up here, so that will give me a one in that square, and one across here and one down here puts one here and one down here and down here and across there means that that's a digit one and that's finished we have five blocking across here which puts a five into that square there uh, 
Uh, missing numbers here, 6, 7, 9. We've got 9 up here and 9 down there, so we'll get a 9 in that square. And we'll end up with 6 and 7 here, which puts the digits over here at 2 and two and 8. Can we get anything here? I don't know. Anyway, this is 2 and 8, so this has to be... 6 and 9. So our 9 blocking here puts the 9 there and the 6 in that square. Now our 6 across here and 6 down here gives us a 6 in that square. And we can finish this row with an 8. 8 blocks up here gives us an 8 in this square. 7 here. One more number to go here which is 2. The 2 blocks down and gives us the 2 there. Um, and we're left here with Five and seven, I think it is. Okay. Um, right, where to now, Skipper? Um, shall we have a click through the digits and see what we can see? There's probably something easy hanging around. Like this four going up here and four up here and four across there. Gives us four in that square. And four across this row and this row and a four up there means we can finish off the fours. We have five blocking this square and five blocking this square. Oh, I've already got five in this row. That was a bit daft. I'm looking for things that are not there. I should put my glasses on, probably. Uh, six, that's better. This one is for sure. Six down here and six across there. There's our six. And six blocking this square. Oh no, that's going to put sixes there and there. Okay, forget that. Uh, how are we doing on the sevens? Not sure. Eights. Okay, we have 9 across here and 9 across here, which gives me a 9 in this square. 9 blocking up here, up here, and across these two rows. Goodbye, 9. See you again later for another game. Uh, all right, let's come back and see what we're missing again. Uh, we have two blocking this square and two blocking this square here. So in this column, that must be the location for two. Then back this way with the twos. Across and up here will give me a two there. Two down here, down here, across there means there's a two. And um, three then blocking up here and up here and across there means... There's our three, three across here, up here, and up here means we finish off the threes. Five blocking this way and this way. So there's a five and five to the bottom here. Gives us five in that square here. Five blocking here, that's a five. And five across these rows and down here means that's a five. Then the five's going up. Give us our final digit five there. We can place a seven here. Um, right, not much more to go now, is there? There's a two blocking across here, so we'll get that two there. And we'll say the two blocking up here means there's our final two. Here we're looking for an eight. And the eight blocks down giving us an eight here with the eight going up that way, meaning that's an eight there. The last number to place up here is a seven. We also need a seven to finish this block here. Seven going across here and across here. 
give us the sevens there seven up here means there's our seven and the seven across the top there will give us another seven there uh, not much more to go what's the last number here it's a six I think now we also have six blocking here so there's our six and the last number here is an eight the eight going to the top there's our eight and the missing digit here is going to be six that's our guardian medium level as I said generally speaking a game for beginners or ones that beginners can solve pretty reasonably uh, on a Tuesday, I hope to see you again for more Sudoku anytime you're in the mood because there are lots of old games on this channel. Bye bye.